Before we get into the video, we wanted to thank today's video sponsor, Anchor Solix. So it's been a while since we've given you guys a backyard update. We've been working hard back here. Last year, you remember, there was like a bunch of big decks uh, that were sagging and all rotted out, and we've been slowly fixing it up. Uh, this year, we've been working really hard. The one issue is back in this backyard, there's no plugs, there's no power out here yet. Thankfully, we have the Anchor Solix F1200 battery. Uh, come on, let me show you how I've been using it. So this is my DIY deck that I built myself. Uh, the problem is, like I said, there's no power out here, so all of my battery-powered uh, Ryobi tools I charge with this bad boy. Uh, it has six AC outlets in the front of it. Uh, which is more than enough for charging all of my tools at once so all right so we got our four usb ports right here our two usb c ports it has six outlets here we use this all the time when we're camping and it'll support our entire camper so here's your display here it'll tell you how much battery power is left and also how long they expect that to last for you depending on what you're using what you're plugging in um, it has this night light which is really great for at night like if we're setting up our campsite and we get somewhere late that's perfect um, and since we have such a beautiful backyard space i actually like to come out here and work but i often need power for my laptop or my cell phone so the anchor solix f1200 is a 1229 watt hour battery which basically means it's a big battery in the last long time but the most impressive thing to, about this to me is how fast it recharges. In one hour's time, you can charge this battery to 80%. This battery will also maintain its integrity after 3,000 charge cycles, which is approximately 10 years of use. So these things are made to last a long time and they're really just a great asset to have around your home. Right now, the Anchor Solix F1200 has an unheard of deal for Prime Day. They are offering 50% off this battery, which is just insane. Uh, so check out the link in our description and go get that amazing deal for Prime Day. All right, let's see what they got today. I don't know, it's hard to decide without Sarah here. Some kind of chair. Sarah might think that's cute. I think these are all Target. So I think I like this one because it has a cool Paw Patrol thing here and then on the back. Oh, this is Hearth and Hand Magnolia. And on this side, there's like a cute little table here that Sarah I know would like and like a Studio McGee thing, which I think is a, a designer thing. So I think we're going with this one. All right. Thank you. So Sarah's wanted a Target palette for a long time, so I finally bought her one. What do you think? <laughs> $850, we paid for this guy. Let's open it up and see what's inside. We need about $1,700 worth of retail value just to break even, because we sell this stuff around half retail value. I don't know what's in some of these boxes, but let's find out. I see some toilet paper and diapers. So. Yeah, let's start with that kind of stuff here. We got some pillows. Okay. I don't know how much Target stuff costs, but. I mean. Is that a $50 pillow? No. Probably 20 to 25 garage sale item. But look how cute it is. No tag Maybe. on here. We got some some toilet paper here. Okay. <laughs> this is one of the only blankets I see with a wrapper still on That's it. It's a so. cutie pie. All right. So one reason that I really like Target palettes is they have a lot of baby stuff. And moms are on Facebook Marketplace. And this stuff just always sells really well for me. It also has lots of home decor items that I can stage in my own home, make look oh. really pretty and sell for a good profit what? she's really selling it i don't know we could have gotten a pallet for you know four hundred dollars but it's target Sorry. people love target all right we've got a mystery box here Let's see what we got Ooh. okay Ooh. charging cable we need one of these but we have a bunch Whoa. of charging cables they have like 12 of them to How be exact. How much are those? These, I think, I mean, I think they're like 15 bucks a piece. That's, that's a, a good find. That's a tiny little box. I'm, I'm feeling better now. I like it. <laughs> let's open these, yeah. These, these are pretty light. Boots in Barkley. What is this? <laughs> oh, are they just toys? A dog toy? Dog toys, but there are one, two, three, four bags of three. There's 12 dog toys in this okay. box. They're kind of cute. Oh, look, more. Oh. So 24 of these. You're right. This is almost like Target. There's something called Case Pack, which is where mm -hmm. you have like multiples. But those are all, it's all brand new product, which I appreciate because we've had some yeah. used product that is broken and unsellable. So here you go. <laughs> Cake stand. Just plastic, but everybody needs one. Oh, oh sorry. That's okay. This is a heavier mystery box. 
I'm feeling better. I, I thought the CIC one, yeah, get no, get that one right there. This one? Yep. Why? A couple of these mystery boxes <laughs> I saw when we were stacking. Oh this no. One, solo <laughs> cups. A bunch of them, so. Yeah, not great. This is heavier though. This one, we'll see what's in here. All right. Ooh, what's what do this? we got? Ooh. A bunch of one thing. Three of these inside the big box. Okay. Right. In bubble oh. wrap. What is Hold it? Hold on. Tumbler. Oh. Pull it out. What do we got? It is a, what oh, was a Stanley? <laughs> <laughs> Zach, these are nice though. They have like the lid and they're brand new. Brand new, which is key. They're not all scratched dishes, up. Yep. These are great. Sweet. I bet that's still I don't know like how much a, I don't know, this brand $20 is. cup. Anything? I think so. Oh. oh. <laughs> Ten dollars on wow, Target. Wow, they got us. They got us still. good. <laughs> so ten dollars times nine. Ten dollars times nine. That's still a ninety dollar box. Yeah, that's not bad. Yeah, so. I didn't know you could buy these for so cheap. Why does people spend eighty dollars on the Stanleys? I don't know. It says holiday on it, but uh, inside are more of these paper cups. No, red paper cups. <laughs> oh no. So far, I got two boxes of paper cups. All right, We're gonna have to have a big party. Yeah. Okay, mm. okay. Gift box. Christmas. Oh, Christmas. Christmas gift box. Oh, they're cute though. Oh. It says $5 each on them. I love it. I have to keep those around, I guess. Keep them they're for Christmas. cute. That's cute. Okay. How many we got? We got 20 in here. 20. But they're like really hard boxes. 20 times five hundred dollars worth of these. Cute pictures. Okay. That's probably not going to be a 50% retail though, but no. still make some money on them maybe. Yeah. Some mystery boxes on these Target ones too. This is, I'm feeling pretty good. Do you? I'll even, yeah, we haven't even got to this stuff where, why I picked this palette. That's true. I picked it because there were some goodies. Yeah. Here, you open this one. Okay. Get here. Whoops. Brand new product too. Again. I like that. I like that a lot. Testing stuff gets really old, so. Yep. You saw our yeah. last video. It was very depressing as well. We're get, we're going to stay away from electronics for a while. Yep. We got a little burned. Oh, what do we got? Two. Looks like a plate of sorts. Oh, it's gorgeous. Look at this. <laughs> that was quite the reaction. It is, it's, it's cool. <laughs> I love Old it. House plate. Okay, we got to look that up. It's so pretty. I love Jungalo. It's so pretty. Juggalos? Jungalo. $75? No, well, come on. Well, that's on eBay. So this is one of those things, sometimes, that's on Poshmark. Sometimes Target will have something really popular and then it'll sell on Poshmark for like oh, a ridiculous 25. amount. Because... So 25, but on Poshmark, 75, yeah. 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 Can you buy it still? On e no, sold yeah, out. It's it sold says. out. Yep. So that does make yep. it more desirable. Yep. If someone's looking for like this specifically, I think that's really pretty. So does that mean you can get 200% of retail No, value. no. Maybe double? Well, maybe, I, I'll yeah. have to see how, maybe they're more popular than I know. Poof. Pillow. Soft poof. Diapers, size five. We could use these. That Diapers exactly are also- exactly what I need. Very expensive. This is probably like, what, 30 bucks? Probably more like, well, these are bucks? like the off brand. Yeah, probably 30. Still. If you're getting into there Huggies or Pampers, it's like 50. More of these dog toys. Dog toys. Oh no. Okay. We got two bullseye playground boxes here. Yep, so this is probably multiples of something. This is better. All right. Hey, Whoa. you were right. But these are cool. <gasps> what are they? Okay. Bath salt jar. <laughs> That's so bath salt specific. Yeah, so you put it in your bathroom, you put your bath salts in there, you got a little scoop. Well little, little scooper. That's we, a tiny scoop. That is very tiny. <laughs> it almost looks like it for eating, eating them. <laughs> so we each have eight. So there's 16 of these and they retail at $5, $5. piece. $5. That is a good garage sale item. No broken ones either. And I would guess that most people are not gonna use these for bath salts, but. Well, I mean, you might think that this is worthless, but someone like with who's having a, wants to do a wedding on the cheap, these could be like for yeah. flower centerpieces. Right. Lots of stuff will sell, even though you think it's worthless. Right. Pillows. I'm gonna get some of this bedding out of the way. Some of this stuff is sellable, but if it's not in packaging, it's it's difficult. So those might be donates. Maybe. Maybe, yeah. But this one is in packaging, and I know for a fact that this is expensive because I own this bedding set, except for in a different color, and I paid way too much for it. Like 159 or something. Really? Eesh. 
Casa Luna is Target's like very bougie brand. So I can definitely sell this, I bet, for 80 to 100. Jungalo, still in packaging. But that's a good one, right, you said? Yes, what is it? Oh, sheets. Anything jungle that well, has. Well, okay, that's not quite as exciting. It's a little as bit. <laughs> okay, Ooh. what do we get? Whoa. Oh. <laughs> it's a game. It's a game, but there's a bunch of them. Beach catch game. Wiffle ball, Franklin. Sweet. There you go. I, think there's... I, I had this when I was a kid. You did? Yeah. It's pretty Four, fun. Or there's throw, five of them. You can throw them really, really far. That's fun. Them. Let's keep going with the bedding here. <laughs> More loose bedding here. Some beach towels. Yeah. Foam mattress topper, but this is in the bag still, so that is good to go. Very red <laughs> towels. Kind of Christmassy. Uh, they they still have the tags on them. They're just not. They're just red. In packaging and which they're red. No one is gonna buy. <laughs> hey, you know for, for a bad Christmas <laughs> for Christmas. You know what those will be great for is like garage towels, like yeah. clean them. Yeah. Hey, I don't know what it is about this product, but I have probably sold and gotten like 10 of these on a pallet in the past few months. Either no one likes the mop or they just... Or everybody loves it. I don't know. I don't know, yeah. I don't know what it is. Why are people obsessed with this mop? It's like everywhere. This one is perfect because it is brand new, still in plastic. I've gotten these before where they're used and so they're not super sellable, but this one has never been used. So it's there, free. Oh yeah, there's the mop stick with it too. Yeah, cool. Yeah. I'm gonna get this out of the way. This is one reason <laughs> I bought this pallet. I know nothing except I know that Chip and Joanna have the Magnolia line, so I knew this was probably expensive. So yes, let's find is. out. I think that's it. I'm not as good at finding stuff as Sarah. Sarah's like the lister around here. 209. 209, okay. It's smaller than I think I thought, but it's yeah, it's cute. It's black and the cane is black as well. It's pretty. Oh, so yeah, I knew I had the eye. <laughs> All right, so I don't know anything about cookware, but usually it's pretty expensive. Should we look this well, one up? Especially for a whole set, yeah. Yeah. And piece, two hundred dollars on Amazon. Nice. Sweet. That's a good one. That's like one of our best finds. Okay. All right, I want to know how much this space-looking it's so pretty alien thing is it? Yes, Looks I love like it. Looks like it came from it's... the year three thousand. It's pretty scratched up on the top here, so I'll definitely have to note that in the listing, but. Oh, it says right now, 90 bucks. Really? That's it? Yep. Okay. So but everyone needs a little side table somewhere. You can get 50 for that easy. Yeah, yeah, definitely 50. Sweet. For sure. Especially if I make it look cute in my own house. Pictures are key. More loose bedding here. Can't do much with that. Well. Besides donate or maybe, yeah. I could use it myself. All right, got a little lamp here. I know that these are pretty cheap at Target, five or 10 bucks. And a little bird cage. That's the thing with the Target pallets. I think how they get you is you're like, oh, I could keep some of that myself, <laughs> yeah. sell the rest of it, and then get some free Target stuff. That's true. It's so true. But these dog toys? Oh no, what is that? What is that? Oh, little, little brass hooks. Nine of them looks like. Oh no, yeah. two, four, twelve of them. Cool. So. All right. We got safety first. A walker. That's an expensive brand, Safety First, isn't it? I mean, some it's of the a, baby gates have been. It's a baby brand, yeah. I yeah. bet it's eighty bucks. Clothes rack uh, on the cheaper end, but you know what? Someone will buy it because everyone needs a place to hang your clothes, right? <laughs> yes. Okay. Digital tower fan. It is super hot this week in Michigan, so this will. I'll put this up right away. It'll sell probably for twenty to forty. All right. This is one we don't want the girls to see. <laughs> Paw Patrol four-wheeler electric. Oh, it's electric? Yeah. Nice. 80 bucks. Nice. There you go. That's like, we get a lot of like grandmas on Facebook who like to buy little toys for their house for when their grandkids come. Or birthday gifts. Yeah, like stuff that. like that. Yep. So that stuff is super easy to sell for me. All right. Here's That's a... another reason I picked it. Oh, really? Okay. Yep. Round patio accent table with shelf, but look how cute that she is. Stylish. It yeah. is cute. Curtain rods, which we actually have these exact ones, I believe, or yeah. we have bought them before. No, they're not cheap. Isn't that like a $40 rod or something? I feel like, depending on how long it is, yeah. 40 to 50, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Brand new jute rug, three by five oval, mm -hmm. in, in bag still, so. I sold a lot of those, great. actually. Those That's probably like a $100 rug, isn't it? No, because it's so small. 
Oh, it says was seventy. Yeah, so seventy dollars. Yeah, yeah. I could probably get thirty for it. Being so small, if it were bigger, it's different. But there's a lot of rugs on Facebook Marketplace. So, all right, we got brand new in packaging. Two oh. of these, like tote storage containers. But those brand are great new. for like their cloud. Yeah, these are cloud islands. So these are like their kids line or baby line. More red towels. <laughs> uh, these ones are in bags though. We got an open bag of dirt. <laughs> <laughs> a bag of dirt. It's so weird. Loose bedding. Is that Casaluna again? Casaluna, but Ooh. this one is also loose bedding. It's not brand yeah. new, so maybe you could sell that. Yeah. The white's tricky too. White is know. tricky. Plastic Adirondack chair. It's not broken. It has a salvage sticker well, on it. There's a bee on it. Watch out. Oh, so these two I also knew were going to be good ones <laughs> and that Sarah would like them. So let's do this one first. I think you're going to like this one. Okay. Excellent chair, it says. Studio McGee. I like that. Mm -hmm. Is it a pretty accent chair? Might be purple. <laughs> Pink. Okay. Oh. Ooh! It's the Buca. It's, it's that trendy stuff that looks like a stuffed animal. No, it looks like right, like a sheep. Here, let's show yeah, them. that's a sheep. good one. Fake sheepskin. Fake sheep. <laughs> oh, can you guys see that? Oh, that's heavy. Probably gonna leave it in there with plastic on it because yeah, they don't want to get dirty. But brand that... new. What do you think that costs? Ah, uh, I don't know. It's a barrel chair. Two. 100, 250 maybe. All right, let's look it up. But again, I will style this in my own home while if you if you let me take it up plastic, but I think it's worth yeah. it. Yeah, you'll be able to get more for it, more than 50% for Put sure. Put it up against my cute wallpaper. It's 240 at Target. On yeah. sale was 300, so okay. I bet you could get, what'd you say? I think 150. Yeah, for sure, at least. Although I, I have a hunch this little style is going out, so. I never liked it. I know, I didn't really either, but cool. I don't know. Sweet. Maybe have to catch someone real quick while they still like it. <laughs> All right, last one, heavy. Heavy one. Oh, oh, okay. It's more than one. That's good. I know exactly what this is. Oh, we used to have these too. Yeah, we did. And I, ooh. ooh. That's okay. <laughs> They're still brand new, I think. There was just a hair on it, but. Four? Are bar there four? Bar stools. Wait. Yeah, it's a three, three pack. Oh yeah, that's a okay. three pack of bar stools. Hopefully. We had these in our um, last house because they were the cheapest <laughs> ones that you could get with fabric and they looked cool. But they so, look nice. Yeah. 150. On sale. On sale from 190. 90. So. Yeah, yeah, that's 50 bucks a piece. So same yeah. price, I guess, but they're really nice. And uh, these are again, are ones I'll probably style in my own kitchen cause it'll be worth it. Mm -hmm. But I'll still call them new. Yeah. Um, yeah, they're not dirty at all. And they're really so. versatile, like good would work for anybody because they're gray and they're pretty. Yeah, so, sweet. I think this was a good Target haul. I think so too. I don't think our MSRP is going to be super high, but this stuff's definitely sellable. Yes. Brand new. Sometimes high MSRP can be, you know, not reliable because the stuff isn't super sellable. So we could have, you know, 10 broken TV monitors. Yes, so. that happened once very recently. <laughs> So if you haven't watched that video yet, go watch it. But we do make money doing this. We believe it's a great side hustle for mm -hmm. anyone looking to get ahead financially. Dollar per hour, it's definitely worth your time. So that's a lot of fun. Yeah. If you're interested in our other pal flipping videos, we will link the whole playlist below so you can go watch them. Thanks for watching guys. See you next time. Bye.